Hi everyone. Are you ready to go on an adventure with Chickpea and her friends? Don't forget to say the magic words. Clap your hands and off we go. Chickpea and friends, come and say hello. Hello, Chickpea. Hello, Trickle. Hi, Stomp and Chirp. Hi, Lemon. Hi, Scoff. <laughs> hello, Jangle. You're going on a trip to the lake? Can we come too? To the lake. Let's join the dots and find out how she's getting there. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Have you guessed yet? You're right! In her car! What about your friends, Chickpea? The car isn't big enough for all of you. Ah, Chickpea's friends are travelling to the lake by bus. <laughs> Look, here they are. Hi, everyone. <laughs> travelling by bus is so much fun. I wonder what they can see through the window. There's a train. A fire engine. <laughs> and Lennon in a hot air balloon. Hi, Lennon! <coughs> you can see the lake from up there. How exciting! Chickpea and her friends are going to have so much fun today. <laughs> story time. Today's story is called Mud. Glorious mud. It was raining in Chickpea's world. Outside, the grass was very wet and very muddy. But Stomp, Scoff and Jangle were having a great time squelching in the mud in their raincoats and boots. Jangle had lovely yellow boots. Stomp had bright red ones. And Scoff had green boots. The friends had so much fun jumping up and down in the puddles until suddenly Stomp jumped into a very deep, muddy puddle. Oh, no! cried Stomp. I'm stuck! Oh, Stomp, you are silly, said Scoff. Come on, let's get you out. Stomp reached up with his trunk for Scoff's paw. But Stomp was too strong and accidentally pulled Scoff into the puddle with him. Now, both of them were stuck and covered in mud. Don't panic! cried Jangle, extending her long neck over the puddle. Hold on to me! Both Stomp and Scoff held on tightly to Jangle's neck. She pulled and pulled and then... Jangle slipped and tumbled into the puddle too. Oh dear! They looked at each other and started to laugh. They laughed so loudly that they didn't hear Chickpea arriving in her little red car. <laughs> 
What in the world is going on? asked Chickpea. <gasps> oh, thank goodness you're here, said Jungle. We've had a little accident. A little accident? It's a mud bath. Chickpea knew she had to help her friends. So she grabbed some rope from the boot of her car, tied the rope to the back of the car and threw the other end to her muddy friends. Hold on tight. Ready? Ready, shouted Jangle, Scoff and Stomp. Chickpea drove her car forward steadily and slowly Jangle, Scoff and Stomp were pulled out of the muddy puddle safely. Hooray! Everyone shouted. Thank you, Chickpea. I think we've had enough rain and mud for one day, said Jangle. OK, first one home gets into the bath, shouted Stomp. And off they went, laughing and giggling. Look, everyone. Scoff and Chickpea have arrived at the lake. You're counting the boats. Can we count them too? Ready? One. Two, three, four, five. Let's count them again. Ready? One, two, three, four, five. Well done, everyone. We've helped Scoff and Chickpea count the boats on the lake. Today's number. Five. Five boats. Five. We've seen all sorts of vehicles today. Can you match this shadow to its picture? Is it a train? A bus? Or a rocket? Would you like a clue? Some of the animals travelled on one of these to the lake today. You think it's a bus? Let's see if you're right. everyone. It's a bus. <laughs> it's time for the crew to travel back home now. They've had a great day at the lake. See you for more fun with Chickpea and friends next time. <laughs> <laughs>